I told you guys in the last video that I quit my job, but I never really like said why. Um, I thought I did, like I meant to, but I went back and watched the video after I uploaded it and I was like, wait a second, I didn't even tell them why I quit. Um, I quit because I did my first wedding video like a week and a half, two weeks ago, and within 24 hours of me releasing the video, like publishing it, posting it on Facebook, I got like literally, I'm not kidding, 10 plus wedding bookings, like additional wedding bookings. So my business is blowing up um, to say the least, and I say that like, um, humbly and modestly, I'm not trying to like brag, but it's blowing up and I was gonna have to take off like pretty much every weekend or every other weekend in the spring coming up when like I have a lot of weddings. So there was just no point of me working um, for SkyZone anymore. That's kind of how it works guys. Like you start a business and you continue to work your job that you already had. And as the business gets bigger, you start needing to put more time into it and it starts to kind of take place over your jobs. It's super tempting for me just to like look back and say like, wow, just a few months ago, I dropped out of college and within this short amount of time, I've had so much success and just like so much good stuff has happened in such a short amount of time. It's super easy for me to do that. Um, but I'm really just trying to keep my head down, stay focused, not be like satisfied with what I've done so far and just like really not let up with the amount of effort because like I've been grinding really hard like the past couple months and I don't want to like get content and comfortable because um, I think if I just keep putting the same amount of effort I have in the past couple months, I really think like in a year, I'll just look back and say like, look what I've done, you know, it's gonna be crazy. I'm just trying to continue to remind myself that like, yes, you can make it without college, but you have to work like 10 times as hard as the person that goes to college and gets a degree. All right, so I'm about to go do something really cool. Um, one of my friends, her name is Hannah. She is a professional dancer. So I'm about to go make a video of her and her friend dancing. I'm not sure what song they're gonna dance to yet, but it's gonna be really cool, I think. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that workout edit. Um, I'm here gonna review some BPI Sports products. Um, they emailed me and asked me to review some of these products. They asked me to review four to five of them. Um, as you can see, I only have three products here. Now I very easily could have um, did what they asked and reviewed four to five products. I could have like pulled another one from the pantry that I have and reviewed it. But I wanted to be honest with you guys. I wanted to be open with you guys and I only wanted to review the products that I actually use on like a weekly basis. So Best BCA Shredded, probably my favorite product from BPI Sports right now. If you guys aren't familiar with what uh, BCAs are or amino acids, they're basically a product that's gonna help you uh, recover quicker. They're gonna prevent muscle breakdown. Um, so you're not gonna be as sore the next day after like uh, lifting weights and stuff like that. We have a regular Best BCA, but we also just came out with a Best BCA Shredded not too long ago. Basically what the difference is, they just added in citrulline, which is gonna give you like a really good pump when you're working out. Now, a lot of people get this confused. A branched chain amino acid is not a pre-workout. It's not a stimulant. It's not gonna give you a whole lot of energy. You can't replace a pre-workout. So um, what I like to do is drink this during my workout. Um, but before that, as a pre-workout, I like to drink one of these two products. I'll either take the BPI Sports Band pre-workout or I'll take the 
BPI Sports, one of our Vortex pre-workout. If I just need like a little bit of an energy boost, a little bit of a mental focus boost going into my workout, I'll just take the one of our Vortex. It's nothing too crazy. It's a little bit of a milder pre-workout, which is perfect for people like me who don't take pre-workout every day and have a high sensitivity to caffeine. Um, if you are sensitive to caffeine though, or you want a really like big energy rush and you want to feel like actually strong in the gym, not just like mental focus, I would go with the BAM, which is what I do sometimes when I'm like really tired. Like I said, uh, it's got 250 milligrams of caffeine, three grams of citrulline. It's definitely a lot stronger than the Vortex. So yeah, to sum it up, depending on how I'm feeling, if I just want a small energy boost and more of a mental focus, I'll take the one of our Vortex. And if I'm feeling really tired and I really need a big energy boost, I'll take the BPI Sports BAM. And then during my workout for a good pump and just like overall recovery the next day from lifting heavy weights, I'll drink this Best BCA Shredded. These two products, the One of Our Vortex and the Best BCA Shredded, you can find pretty much anywhere online, Vitamin Shop and GNC, I believe. And then the BAM is a GNC exclusive. So if you guys want to pick up this pre-workout, you have to go to GNC in-store and pick it up. Highly recommend it, guys.